Welcome to On The Real with Sugar. My name is Gary Barnage, half of Cinnamon and Sugar. I want to welcome you to the new series that I'm starting. We're going to be diving into movies, which is my forte. I love movies, so we're going to dive in. We're going to dissect the movies. We're going to compare remakes to originals. We're going to talk about one-offs. We're going to talk about series. So sit down, come enjoy, and we're going to have a lot of fun. And as you can see, what I ordered first, we're going to start off with the movie It. So like I said, we're gonna start with the movie It. There's one movie, and then they made a remake recently. The original movie, a lot of people don't know, was a TV movie. It was made for TV, it was three hours long, which is why it's not as gory as the new one is. So we're gonna start off talking about the original, because the original is where it all started. It's where the whole thing, obviously Stephen King had a book on it, and I haven't read the whole book all the way. It is huge, but it's definitely one that everybody says you need to check out. I'm going to finish reading it, but that's what this movie is based off of. So we're going to dive into it. I want to show you all something first. This is from a scene from the movie. This is the, the uh, Losers Club. So this is them, and then you see Pennywise the Clown back here in the back. So I got this done, and then I got this done. It's basically the same exact thing, except for they're older. Because in the movie, things happen 20 years apart. So it happens when they're a kid, and it happens again when they're older. I know this movie itself created the whole huge fear of clowns and people. But for me, it was just something that resonated because it was so different. It is a terrifying joy to watch. It is something I would recommend to anybody to watch. I definitely think it is something that you don't want your kids to watch. Maybe, maybe 10, 11, my kids won't have kids. But it is one movie that it is high ranking on my all time horror movies. So we dove into the original It. Now, we're gonna talk about the remake. So the remake just came out a few years ago. It had a stellar cast. Uh, I thought they did an amazing job recreating the atmosphere that the original portrayed. Uh, Skarsgård was, uh, was the clown this time, was Pennywise the clown. Uh, they took a different couple liberties with the way the story played out, which they had to because that is part of making a remake. You can't make it scene for scene the same thing. But it is a movie that, again, I don't know if there's much that needed to be done. They made it a little more, um, I guess, out there with the clown and they had a little, were able to make it a little more gory because it wasn't a made for TV movie. So that plays a big part in it because you can show more detail and more graphic scenes that were in the book that or in this movie that weren't in the original because they were only able to do a limited amount of work because again, made for TV versus a theater release. But all in all, I do think they did a great job with the movie. I, I enjoyed it. I know a lot of people were looking forward to it. Uh, they made it into two films instead of just one. So you had to go back and wait a year and a half or whatever for the next one to come out and watch it there. So great marketing strategy. It was a joy to watch. Um, and then we are gonna discuss after, I am gonna discuss which one I like better between the original or the remake. And that's where we're coming to next. Stick to. So now we're gonna discuss the pros and cons of the original and the remake. So the biggest pro for me from the original versus the remake was Pennywise the Clown. Tim Curry was amazing as Pennywise the Clown. Skarsgård did great, but his was a little more hokey, more not as, I didn't feel it was like as, as sinister as Pennywise was in the original. I felt it was a little more hokey 
and they had a little more CGI aspects in it. So for me, the clown was so much better in the original. And now I'm gonna say the acting, the new one, the cast as adults, the kids were amazing. I thought they were better than the original. The original kids were great, actors were great, but I thought the acting in the second one was much better, but still, it's a horror movie. It's really hard to be acting in a horror movie because there's only so much you can do. So the whole thing boils down to the movie is about Pennywise a clown and these kids and these adults as they're adults. So to me, the whole film is made by the acting of Pennywise. And I think Tim Curry was outstanding. And I think for me, that's what puts the original over the remake because it was just so good as a, of a performance. And the fact that it was a TV movie versus a theater just makes it even better that it was that good of a movie as a TV movie. But I am a true and true to the end. The original is better than the remake. If you have a problem with that, you can talk to Tim Curry as Pennywise and I'm sure he'll he'll help you out because I heard they all float down there, so. Uh... Oh yes, yeah. they float, Georgie. They float. Just talk, take it up with him, don't take it up with me. Go back and watch both and you'll see the original clown was much better, but that will end the first episode of On The Real with Sugar, AKA Gary Barnage. I appreciate you joining me. This was a great experience. We'll be back with many, 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 many more movies. We're gonna be talking about so many different things. So I hope you enjoyed my breakdown of it.